I'm sure you guys have noticed that I have popped myself into Australia and then today I'm actually in Tasmania. We randomly booked a flight, got on a plane and we are here in Launceston. I am so excited for today's video because it's not just today's video, it's going to be a few videos because we are road tripping around Tasmania and I am so excited to bring you guys along because this place looks incredible. First things first, we grabbed our bags and went straight to our hotel change overnight. We picked this hotel because of its location, modern apartments, and the fact that a portion of the proceeds go to charity, which is awesome. Now let's check out Launceston. A local had recommended us this little wine bar called Havila. We did their $50 set menu, which featured a duck confit. Pair that with a local Tazitino. You have the perfect introduction to Tasmania. So we are at Bread and Butter and I am going to try Bolite, which is like the natural version of Vegemite. I'm not the biggest fan of Vegemite. I don't even know the proper ratio. Lightly. Lightly. I don't even know how to describe that to anybody. It's like this salty taste. Stop putting any more on. Just leave the amount that's already there. Okay. It's not my jam. That Australians love it. <laughs> So we just had lunch at Stillwater, which is one of the best restaurants in Launceston. Oh my God, we were so lucky to get a last minute reservation and it was so good. We had oysters and scallops. For those of you who don't know, Tasmania is known for their oysters and scallops, particularly seafood in general, and they were beautiful. We also had the softest, beautiful ocean trout and it was local too. This place is also one hat, which is equivalent to like one Michelin star. So if you're coming to Tasmania or you're coming to Launceston, this place has to be on your list. I'm so full, but I wish I had ordered more. <laughs> just finished up at one of the most incredible places I have ever been is floating sauna on Lake Derby guys this needs to be on your bucket list it's so peaceful and quiet and incredibly beautiful this place is amazing We headed back to get some provisions, some bread, some pastries, and most importantly, coffee. <laughs> so now we're about to head on the road and Launceston, you're a little sleepy, but we did eat well here. So really excited to see what the rest of Tasmania has in store for us. So let's get going. You could smell this, but there are eucalyptus trees everywhere. We just stopped to the side of the road and there's fresh bread. Personal winner is paleo. We're here for two days. How many times do you guys think we're gonna come here? Three times? You can say I, lost my mind. I, I don't think it's a beach day. We're at Cloudy Bay, which is known for surfing, not for the wine, just in case you were wondering.
Jumping from cliffs so high, trusting our wings to fly.